Several thousand people are expected on a march in Berlin to remember an anti-fascism activist murdered in the early 90s. Germany is still striving to ban far-right parties who nurture political and social views the country is trying to forget. Peter Oliver now reports. The horrors of Germany's history with the far right are perhaps no better illustrated than here in central Berlin at the memorial to those who were murdered during the Holocaust. Later on Saturday, though, we're potentially going to see clashes between far right neo Nazis and anti fascist groups, both here in Berlin and other cities perhaps around the country. Now, here in Berlin, it's taking part in the memorial to the murder of an anti fascist activist who was stabbed to death in a Berlin metro station 21 years ago. Now, in the past, that has resulted in clashes between the far right and the far left. Now, to find out a little bit more about the role of the far right and how they still exist here in modern Germany, I'm joined by Dr. Uh, Gideon Bosch. Thank you very much, a historian and political scientist. Now, we stood next to the Holocaust Memorial. Perhaps there is no more poignant memorial to the horrors of Nazism. How much do these neo-Nazis relate to the, the dictatorship of the 1930s and 40s? They are neo-Nazis. They are definitely proud of this uh, regime and they want to re-establish a rule uh, comparable to Nazi rule. But who are these people? Where do they come from within society? I mean, you look around modern Germany, the reminders are still there of the, the suffering of the German people under Nazism. How can people turn towards images like the swastika? It's um, very different how they uh, come to this movement, um, very different ways to get into the movement. But we find in many cases, we find a fascination of national socialist rule. They want to, uh, they are really fa fascinated by Hitler and by the SS or by the Wehrmacht and they uh, do not believe, they don't believe in what they learn in school about German and European history. Thank you very much. That was Dr. Gideon Bosch, a political scientist and historian, speaking to me there about modern day neo-Nazism and fascism here in Germany. Throughout the day, I'll be bringing you updates on what's going on here on RT.